As we reflect today on the destructive nature of war, we strengthen our resolve to act in the world stage in spirit of friendship and reconciliation. We remember our forebears, their sacrifice, and the values they strove to upheld. We pay respect to the individual men and women who left their families, friends, and communities to serve their country. In his poem, Tears, etc., Dennis Walsh captures the feeling of alienation felt by many returned service men and women. Instead of the smell of death, there were stations and faces and children thrust into our arms, the old life reclaiming us, tea, cups and saucers, the sound of a single car in the street, a plate held out with the future on it, looks, unbridgeable silences, tears, etc. In these lines, we recognise the scars of war and their lasting impact on individuals, families and communities. A deeper knowledge and understanding of our history will enable us to arrive at a more confident understanding of who we are in the present, as well as a clearer vision of who we wish to be.